Miguel Cabrera just reached the 3,000 hit milestone and he may be the last player to ever do it. He becomes the 33rd member of the 3,000 hit club. Stay till the end of the video for my best candidate for 3,000 hits, but I don't think anyone will get there. We don't know that for sure, but it's questionable whether any of the active players in Major League Baseball are going to be the next member. The closest candidate is Robinson Cano. As a 39-year-old with 2,631 hits, he'll need 369 more, and it's going to be tough for him to get there as he has not had very many healthy seasons recently. The next best candidate that we could see do it soon is Jose Altuve at 1,783 hits, but it's going to be really tough for him to get there as he is already 31. Freddie Freeman with 1,722 is going to struggle to get there based on the fact that he's already 32 and his career might be winding down soon. The next best guy would probably be Manny Machado with 1,445 hits and he's only 29. Although Trout was on an amazing pace to get to this wonderful milestone, Trout is now struggling with some health issues and has struggled to play a full season recently. To check in on some of the young guys that may be able to do this, but it's going to be 10 plus years till they get there, let's look at Ozzy Albies, a 25 year old, 628 hits. He broke into the league a little too late, but I wouldn't count him out. And then next, would be Juan Soto, who's already at 500 hits as a 23-year-old. Soto has one of the best combinations of contact, power, and plate discipline, and he would be my pick for your next guy to get to 3,000 hits, as he's only 23 years old. Soto is definitely the number one candidate to be the next guy to eclipse the amazing milestone of 3,000 hits and become the 34th member of the exclusive club. Hit number 3000 is extremely special. Getting to witness Miggies as a Tigers fan is one of the best experiences you can have.